Now to the race for Congressional District 28. Now this is Henry Cuellar's longtime seat. It is a long and narrow district, covers Mission to Laredo, then juts up to the outskirts of San Antonio. Two challengers looking to bump Cuellar, but it is not going to happen. The AP already calling this one for Congressman Cuellar. Channel 5's Christian Von Pricing live in Mission with reaction. Hey, Christian. Hey, Christine, we've been monitoring that race here for Mission at the Mission Fire Department and also just watching as some of that late voting happened. The polls, of course, of course closed at 8 p.m. and people were still in line until about 9 p.m. waiting for their turn now that they, they had already gotten in line before 8 p.m. Uh, going to that race, Congressman Henry Cuellar declared the winner by the Associated Press and uh, his challenger, uh, Sandra Witten, also, uh, you know, looking at this as, as some kind of a success as well because of the margin that they were able to accomplish as a Republican in a heavily Democratic area. Witten, of course, talking a lot about border security. Congressman Henry Cuellar talking a lot about his previous accomplishments already, expanding higher education uh, in the Valley and in South Texas, as well as um, his position on the House Appropriations Committee as the only Texas Democrat. So we spoke to Congressman Henry Cuellar about how he's feeling tonight about these results. So what we're going to do now is we're going to get started uh, working uh, tomorrow. In fact, um, on Thursday, I'll be traveling out to uh, the northern part of the district, Bear County, uh, Wilson, Atascosa. And then next week, I'm going to go back to Hidalgo uh, to start County and Zapata. I'm going to go visit every single town, uh, visit with people uh, at every city in my district uh, to uh, ask them, hey, look, uh, hopefully we'll have a new president, number one. Uh, number two, what should I focus on as a member of Congress? Again, Congressman Henry Cuellar with a strong enough lead in this race tonight that the Associated Press has declared him a winner. We're still waiting for those final results to come in, but he has been declared a winner in this race. Reporting live, Christian Mon Pricing, Channel 5 News at 10.